Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 28th of March 1871, the Paris Commune was proclaimed and met for the first time. The city of Paris had been besieged by the Prussian army since September 1870. Following the surrender of the moderate Republican government the following January, many Parisians, of whom thousands had joined the National Guard militia to defend the city, revolted. They refused to hand over the 400 cannons positioned in Paris to government forces and, on the 18th of March, killed two generals from the regular army who had been sent to take the cannons by force. The government, regular forces and police subsequently evacuated the city for Versailles. The vacuum of power was filled by units of the National Guard. By the next evening, the red flag of the Commune was flying over the Hôtel de Ville. Elections were called, and on the 26th of March, 92 representatives were elected to form the Commune Council. However, as a result of some nominees securing victories for multiple seats, and some candidates who had been nominated without their approval refusing to take up their seat, only 60 representatives actually joined the council. The results were declared on the 27th of March, and the council held its first meeting the following day. Within a week, however, the first skirmishes between the Commune's National Guard and the regular army from Versailles had begun. The refusal of the Communards to accept the authority of the French government led to the Commune being brutally suppressed by the regular French army in May during the Bloody Week. By the 28th of May, the Commune had been defeated. Estimates say that between 10 and 50,000 Communards were killed or executed. <laughs>